My name is uh, Professor Liam Sinclair uh, and I work here at Harper Adams University. Harper Adams is uh, uh, based on a rural campus in Shropshire where we have a range of different activities. Uh, we're based uh, currently here on the dairy unit but we also have beef, sheep, pigs, poultry and a range of different uh, combinable crops. Uh, and that's a big advantage in that we can easily access those uh, in terms of teaching and in terms of research. Currently on the dairy unit we have uh, projects looking at reducing the methane output from dairy cows. Uh, this is a very topical area, something that farmers are interested in, something that the general public is interested in. And we have these facilities which allow us to uh, feed different additives that farmers can feed, uh, but also then to measure the cow's intake and to measure the the methane output from individual cows and this provides information for farmers that they can then use on farm commercially but it also uh, underpins our teaching so our final year undergraduate students for example do a research project and they're involved with doing this as well as the information then underpinning what we teach other students as well. One of the big advantages that we have here is that it's a rural campus uh, and students have access to all the commercial farm activities. So when they need to be involved in, and see particular activities, whether that is related to crops or uh, related to spraying or related to animal handling or uh, administering uh, different substances, then that's easily accessible. It only takes a, a matter of a few minutes for the students to come out and be able to uh, have practical experience. And that practical experience experience is important then to underpin what they're being taught in the classes uh, so that they can see what's being put into practice. Shout About Farming is a wonderful initiative in that it's attempting to bridge the gap between consumers and the farming community and that's an important aspect. There's lots of wonderful things that dairy farmers do, that uh, beef farmers do, that uh, crop farmers do and we really need to make consumers aware of the quality of the produce that's being produced on farm the high quality of welfare that we have looking after our, our animals so that they can see where that, that comes from and have confidence in the products that they're buying in the shops. Hello, uh, my name's Louisa Dines. I'm a Principal Lecturer in Agronomy here at Harper Adams. I think that a lot of the challenges around obviously sustainability um, and profitability and we spent the last year um, working hard on um, our new curriculum and trying to address some of those challenges and trying to fill some of the skills gaps in the industry so we're really looking at building a curriculum which develops a lot of the, the skills that students need in the agricultural industry as well as the the knowledge. Every day is uh, open day here at Harper Adams and we have visitors all the way through from preschool up to uh, cabinet ministers and royalty. So we want to make sure that, that we engage with the, with the community, uh, that people can feel that they can come and see what's going on um, and therefore have an appreciation of where their food's produced, how it's produced, um, so that when they go and, and purchase it they know where it's come from and they feel that they've got greater confidence. I think it's really important to um, sort of develop more understanding of a more appreciation um, amongst consumers of where food is coming from um, and to sort of balance the story um, around agriculture because the press isn't always um, favourable so it's it's good for agriculture to have an opportunity to show showcase um, you know the the developments in sustainability, the way that the land is managed, being managed, um, the way that um, animals are looked after um, and to provide some of that balance really. Hello, my name's Eleanor Gilbert and I'm currently studying Agriculture and Crop Management at Harper Adams University. I haven't been brought up with a farming background but I now live on my family arable farm in Berkshire whilst documenting my life on YouTube and social media channels to really grow interest in agriculture and bridge the knowledge gap between the general public and farmers. When I came to visit as a um, 
student looking at Harper. It just felt like a, a community and a great place to be. And they also had very good practical learning experiences. You know, they've got the full dairy here, the beef, the pigs and the sheep, um, and also arable learning. Um, I also think that Harper Adams holds a lot of credence in the industry um, and people that have been here and studied at Harper know it's no mean feat. You know, agriculture is the biggest job on the planet. There's so many opportunities in farming from, you know, flying a drone, engineering, livestock, veterinary, and even, you know, a lot of technology now is being involved in agriculture. Come and visit Harper or even some of the colleges around and you might be surprised how much opportunity there is in the agricultural sector. I think there's a much uh, more diverse range of opportunities than, than people are aware of um, from pursuing an agricultural degree and you have to think about all the sort of steps in the, the food supply chain and industry um, and right up to sort of supermarkets and procurement and buyers um, and all the advice that goes into um, the sector. So I think it's to really sort of dig around and, and look at that range of careers.